If we'd like to look up a current license or registration in the lookup system, we can either look up a group of licenses or for an individual. We'll start by looking up a group. If, for instance, we're looking for a home improvement contractor located in Hartford, we can scroll to our home and contractor list, click on that license type. We'd also want to select active, people who are currently uh, have active licenses as opposed to those who are inactive and not eligible to work under that credential and those that are pending and may or may not become active. And then we go to city and we're going to list Hartford. And now if we click search, that brings a, up a list with more than 10 pages of contacts. And we can go scroll through and go to different pages to see which active licensed uh, home improvement contractors there are. If, however, we know the name of a contractor and we'd like to see if they have an active license or registration, we can put that right into the business name here. I know there's a business hall of Connecticut gutters, so I will put in their name. When I click search, it's showing me that it's not listed. However, I may be looking it up incorrectly. If I type CT gutter, hit search, now I find them because it has to be an exact match from the beginning of the name. Similarly, if I just type gutter, it finds a different company. Uh, gutter does not start their legal name, however, it does start their DBA, they're doing business as, their trade name. So you must be careful about how you list company's name. And once you do find the company that you would like, you can get a little more detail by clicking on the detail button. It shows you their current license when it began. This one was November 2015 and when it's due to expire. But please note this is just the current version of their license. They may have had the license going back a number of years, but this just shows the current renewal period.